We're starting at X. And you maybe you only need 3 to 5% growth per year to get to Y. It doesn't matter if the markets make 20% or lose 20%, as long as you're keeping on your path. And by meeting regularly with your financial advisor, it helps you adjust those curves and those detours along the way. So that I would like to be your one takeaway from today is despite what situations you think, whether you think you don't have enough money, whether you think you have too much money, whether you think this or that, sit down with Andrina, share your needs, wishes, and wants with her so she can help you figure out the best way to get that path from X to Y. So today's presentation is called Investing Today, Keeping Perspective in Volatile Markets. The agenda is evaluating volatility, which we've already started to do here. Consider the noise, understand your threshold, focus on what you can control, and communicate your needs. <clears throat> evaluating volatility, as I mentioned before, it's inherent in investing. It can create some mispricing in, in your securities, can often cause us to react emotionally, and is a large function of time. Now, the key about can often cause us to react emotionally. That one probably hits the most at home because right now we're all a little concerned or a lot concerned, depending on your <clears throat> risk tolerance, about how much we've lost this year already. That is a concern and it's a valid concern. But again, keep it in perspective and spend time with Adrena to help figure out the best path to move forward from here. At Bright House Financial, we offer some investment solutions through Oppenheimer and Andrina that will allow you to, I call it, weather the storm by having the upside opportunity linked to the S&P 500, but offering you some downside protection that if we are down like we are now, that you would not have lost any money. So that's something to share and think about when you meet with her. So here's an exercise. No one told you there weren't going to be a test today. Well, there's a test here. Very simple. If you have the choice to invest,